Do you ever feel like you're drowning in a sea of bills? You're not alone. Millions struggle with financial stress, a constant weight on their shoulders. This stress can impact every aspect of your life, from your relationships to your health. It's time to break free from this cycle and take control of your finances. There's a simple, effective solution that can change everything, the 70-20-10 rule. Imagine a life where you confidently manage your money knowing exactly where it's going. Picture yourself saving for your dreams without feeling deprived. With the 70-20-10 rule, this vision can become your reality. It's a straightforward budgeting method that empowers you to allocate your income effectively. This allows you to achieve financial stability and pursue your goals. Financial stress can feel like a never-ending battle, but there's a way out. The 70-20-10 rule offers a lifeline, a path towards financial peace of mind. The 70-20-10 rule is a simple yet powerful budgeting strategy. It allocates your after-tax income into three main categories. 70% goes towards needs, essential expenses like housing and groceries. 20% is for savings and debt repayment. The remaining 10% is for wants, things that bring joy. This rule helps you enjoy your money while staying financially responsible. The 50-30-20 rule is another popular budgeting method that allocates 50% of your income to needs, 30% to wants, and 20% to savings and debt repayment. While both rules share the goal of promoting financial responsibility, there are key differences in their approach. The 70-20-10 rule places a greater emphasis on needs and savings, recognizing the importance of financial security. The higher allocation for needs in the 70-20-10 rule provides a larger buffer for essential expenses, reducing financial stress. This can be particularly beneficial for those with fluctuating incomes or unexpected expenses. The increased focus on savings allows for faster debt repayment and wealth accumulation, building a stronger financial foundation. While the 50-30-20 rule allows for more spending on wants, it may not be suitable for everyone. Those with high debt or limited income may find the 30% allocation for wants unsustainable. The 70-20-10 rule offers a more conservative approach, prioritizing financial stability over immediate gratification. The 70-20-10 rule stands out for its simplicity and psychological appeal. Its straightforward structure makes it easy to understand and implement, even for those new to budgeting. Unlike complex budgeting systems, the 70-20-10 rule requires minimal tracking and calculations, making it a sustainable long-term strategy. The psychological power of the 70-20-10 rule lies in its balanced approach. It acknowledges the importance of both financial responsibility and enjoying your money. By allocating a portion of your income to wants, the rule prevents feelings of deprivation and promotes a healthy relationship with money. This balanced approach fosters sustainable financial habits. The clear allocation of funds reduces financial stress and provides a sense of control over your finances. Knowing that your essential needs are covered and that you are actively saving for your future brings peace of mind. This sense of control empowers you to make informed financial decisions and pursue your goals with confidence. Real-life success with the 70-20-10 Rule Inspiring Stories Countless individuals have transformed their financial lives using the 70-20-10 Rule. Sarah, a single mother, paid off debt and built an emergency fund using the Rule. Her story shows the power of the 70-20-10 Rule. John, a recent graduate, saved for a home down payment with the rule. His success highlights the rule's effectiveness. These stories are not isolated incidents. Many have used the 70-20-10 rule to achieve financial freedom and pursue their dreams. Implementing the 70-20-10 rule a step-by-step -step guide. Implementing the 70-20-10 rule is a straightforward process. First, calculate your after-tax income. This is the amount you have available to allocate after taxes and deductions. Next, categorize your expenses into needs, wants, and savings. Be honest with yourself about what constitutes a need versus a want. Once you have categorized your expenses, allocate your income according to the 70-20-10 rule. 70% 70 for needs, 20% for savings, and 10% for wants. Use budgeting tools or apps to track your spending and ensure you stay within your allocated limits. Regularly review your budget and adjust as needed. Adjusting your lifestyle to fit the 70-20-10 rule may require some changes in your spending habits. Look for areas where you can reduce expenses, such as dining out less or finding more affordable entertainment options. Mastering your needs. Defining and managing essential expenses. 
Understanding your needs is crucial for effectively implementing the 70-20-10 rule. Needs are the essential expenses that are non-negotiable for maintaining your current lifestyle. This includes housing, transportation, groceries, utilities, and healthcare. Clearly define your needs and prioritize them within your budget. Accurately assess your spending on needs. Track your expenses for a month to gain a clear picture of where your money is going. Look for opportunities to reduce costs without sacrificing essential services. Negotiate lower bills, find more affordable housing options, or explore cost-effective transportation methods. Managing your needs effectively requires mindful spending. Avoid impulse purchases and prioritize essential expenses. Make conscious choices about where you spend your money. Supercharging your savings, building a financial fortress. Saving 20% of your income is a cornerstone of the 70-20-10 rule. This allocation enables you to build a financial safety net and secure your future. Prioritize building an emergency fund to cover unexpected expenses. Aim for three to six months of living expenses in your emergency fund. Once you have established an emergency fund, focus on paying down high interest debt. This will save you money in the long run and accelerate your progress towards financial freedom. After addressing high interest debt, consider investing for long-term goals such as retirement. Explore various investment options that align with your risk tolerance and financial goals. Diversify your investments to minimize risk and maximize potential returns. Consult with a financial advisor if needed to develop a personalized investment strategy. Regularly review and adjust your investment portfolio. Taming your wants, finding fulfillment without overspending. The 10% allocated to wants in the 70-20-10 rule allows you to enjoy your money without compromising your financial stability. Define your wants and prioritize the activities and purchases that bring you the most joy. Be mindful of your spending and avoid impulse purchases. Set a budget for your wants and track your expenses. This will help you stay within your allocated limit and avoid overspending. Explore affordable entertainment options and find creative ways to enjoy your hobbies without breaking the bank. Prioritize experiences over material possessions. Seek fulfillment beyond material possessions. Focus on building meaningful relationships, pursuing your passions, and contributing to your community. These activities enrich your life and provide lasting satisfaction without requiring excessive spending. Find joy in simple pleasures. Common pitfalls and how to avoid them. One common mistake when implementing the 70-20-10 rule is overspending on wants. This can derail your budget and hinder your progress towards financial goals. Avoid impulse purchases and stick to your allocated budget for wants. Track your spending and make adjustments as needed. Another pitfall is neglecting savings. It's crucial to prioritize saving even when faced with financial challenges. Automate your savings contributions to ensure consistency. Remember that small, consistent savings add up over time and build a strong financial foundation. Failing to adjust your budget regularly can also lead to problems. Review your budget monthly and make adjustments based on your income and expenses. Life changes and your budget should reflect these changes. Embrace financial freedom. Your journey starts now. The 70-20-10 rule is more than just a budgeting method, it's a pathway to financial freedom. It empowers you to take control of your finances, reduce stress, and achieve your goals. By prioritizing needs, savings, and wants, you create a balanced approach to managing your money. Start implementing the 70-20-10 rule today. Assess your income, categorize your expenses, and allocate your funds accordingly. Track your spending, make adjustments as needed, and celebrate your progress. The journey towards financial freedom begins with a single step. Share your experiences with the 70-20-10 rule with others. Inspire them to take control of their finances and pursue their dreams. Connect with a supportive community and learn from each other's successes and challenges. Together, we can achieve financial well-being.